tidings to Mary, and she conceived by the Holy Ghost. Now Mary, for grace the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Behold the handmaid of the Lord, be it done unto me according to thy word. Now Mary, for grace the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us. How Mary, for grace the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. For forth we beseech thee, O Lord, thy grace into our hearts, that as we have known the incarnation of thy Son, Jesus Christ, by the message of an angel, so by his cross and passion may we come to the glory of his resurrection, through the same Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Holy Spirit, 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 the Gretus Deus, voti tu numero al quarto e pulisti il quarto in Cristo in cielo, tu vuoi dire bene, tu vuoi. E mette luce a tua verità, te 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 mette luce a tua verità, Gloria a Patria e Figlio e Spirito e Santo, si coderà tu principio e non che sempre, ed in secura si tu lorum. Amen. E in tuoi volatari dei, e dei in critifica di un tutto meo. O vi porgo nostro in nome di Domini, qui fece cenno e terra. Confitio per il potente via di Maria Santissima, via di Gaia, te amici con Maria tua, e Battista, e Santo Posti, te tu e Paoli, e tu e Maria tua, e non vi lo santi tu, e tu e te, quello da vini, e mi foggi da azione per voi dopo, e me ho culto. Meo culpa, mea massima culpa. E io prego, beata Maria, un sede vigile, nel beato mi dare una pianta, un beato mi vuole battista, un santo sposo, un sede mio fuori, beato mi vuole Maria, un diano, un estratto di vostro arte, orrare come le donne da un naso. Miseria a tutti, un potente di Gesù Cristo, che tanti di Gesù Cristo, e di Gesù Cristo, e di Gesù Cristo, Amen. Confiti, o Deo, mi potenti, beate Maria, un sede vigile, Beato Michele, Beato Angelo, Beato Giovanni Battista, Santi Sposti, Spetto e Paolo, Uomini e Santi, se ti dico a te, qui ho da venire in scogitazione, vengo ad offre, mea culpa, mea culpa, mea massima culpa. E io prego, Beata Maria, un sede vigile, Beato Michele, Beato Angelo, Beato Giovanni Battista, Santi Sposti, Spetto e Paolo, Uomini e Santi, se te fate, orrare con me, ad ogni del mondo. Seriato vesci mi tu tenis e usi tu ispettati svesci ispettu te vosi vita me te am. Amen. Lugene se me sussione me tu missione, me tu torno no sono in tibi vat nozze mi potente misere tu sonos. Amen. Deus tu cum versi scutiti da visnos, et lem tu le tabi tor in te, o senti nomis domine misericordiam tua, et salutare tu un bel nomis. Domine e gloria razione me am, et tremo versa e te bene. Domino suo bispum, et cum spirito tuo, Ordemus. Se cientes venite ad aquas dicit Ordemus, se qui non habetis pretium venite et vivite cum Letizia, attendite popole meus legum meam, inclinate aurum vestum in verbo oris meam. Gloria, Padre e Figlio, e Spirito e Santo, si coderat in principio e non che sempre, ed in secula seculorum. Amen. Si sientes venite ad aquas, dici Dominus, et qui non habet disprezium venite e vivite cum Letizia. Kyria eleison, Kyria eleison, Kyria eleison, Christa eleison, Christa eleison, Christa eleison, Kyria eleison, Kyrie eleison, Kyrie eleison. Un Domino Soviscum et cum Spirito Tuo. Ardemus. 
fiat Domine Caesmus nec ratiam tuam frutuosus nostre devotionis effectus, qui a tu nobis proderum suscepta iaiunia, si tu es in placita pietati. Per Dominum nostrum iaesum Christum filium tuum, qui tecum vivida regna ad unanitati silicus sancti Deus, per Romnia secula seculorum. Amen. Corde, a cum dis nos caesimus domine mentis e populis defendi periculis, et in decidente beatri gloriosi se bevigere et egenetrice e Maria, cum beatu Iosef beatis apostis suis Petru e Paolo, atque beatis cut mani tui filii domibus santis, salutem novis tribui veninus e pacem, udis troxis atque si sasibus et ronibus e nevensis e clese tua supporti bisebi et debitati. Omnipotentem viterne Deus, qui vi volum dominari simiole motu ordum, omniunque misedevis, quos suos fili et opere tutur sese prenoscis, te supices et solavus, ut propibus e fundere pregit e crevimus, quos vi ve pres in seculum et hoc in cane retine, del futurum iam sultus copte copre suscebit, in decidentibus omnibus sanctis tuis, pietatis tuae clemensi omnium delectorum suorum peniam consequantur. Per Dominum nostrum, Ia esum Christum filium tuum, qui tecum vi vita regna ad unanitatis felicus sancti Deus, per Romnia secula seculorum. Amen. Lexo esei profetei, te dici Dominus, in tempore placito exaltivi te, et in die salutis auxiliatus sum tui, et servavi te e dedi te in fedus populi, et suscetar de steram, et posideris ereditates desipata. Udiceris his qui vinti sunt, exite et his in qui in te regris. Revelabili, sube vies pacientur et in omnibus claris vasque orum. Non esurient neque sitient et non pecut siet eus aestus ex ol, qui misedatur e orum regi Deus, et e quantis e quarum putavi Deus. Emponem omnes montes meus in piam et semite me ex al caputur. Eci his te de longe veniunt et eci ilia perquilione, aquilone et mari, et isti de terra australi. Laudate, celi, et exulta, terra, jubilate, montes, laudem, quia consolatus est dominus populum suum, et pauperum suorum miseribitur, miseribitur, et dixit zivan, ne diliquit me dominus, et dominus obditus est me. Non quid obribisci potes mulier infantem suum, et non miseriatur filio uteri sui, et si illa oblita, deo erit, Ego tamen non obrifisca, tui dici dominus omnipotens. Deo gratias. Ivi domine de relitus es pauper, cubilo et tu edis a tuto, ut qui domine recisisti donde despicis in opusodatibus in tribulazione, non supervit in pius, incendi tu pauper. Dominus obiscum, et cum spirito tuo, sequentia sancti evangelii secundum Iohannem, gloria et divitamine. In illo tempore lucutus est Iesus turbi sus deorum dicens, ego sum lux mundi, qui sequitur me non ambulat in terribis et habet vid lumen et vite, dixerum tergo e farisei. Tu dedit te ipso testimonium peribes, testimonium tuum non est ver. Respondit Iesus et dictit eis, Et si ego testimonium per hibe ode me ipsum, erum est testimonium meu, que ascio unde vini, et quod vado, vos autem nescitis, unde venio aut quo vado. Vos secundum carmen iudicatis, ego non iudico quem quam. Et si iudico ego iudicium meum verum est, que a solus non sum. Sed ego, et qui misit me pate. Et in lege veste spiritum est, qui ad uorum hominum testimonium verum est. Ego sum, qui testimonium per hibe iude me ipso, et testimonium per hibe de me, qui misit me pate. Diceva tergo ei, ubi est pate tuus? Respondit Iesus, neque me scitis, neque pate meum, si me sceritis fossi tane patum meum sceretis. Forsi, hec verbo locutus est Iesus, in gaso filapio, gazi filacio docent in templo, 
et nemo apprehendi Deum, qui a necum venera corda eus. Laus, tibi Christi. It's the fifth Saturday in Lent. The lesson is taken from the book of the prophet Isaiah. Thus says the Lord, Now the time of pardon has come, in which I will answer thy prayer, the day of salvation, when I will give thee my aid. I have kept thee in readiness to make through thee a covenant with my people. Thou art to revive the ruined land, to divide up the forfeited inheritances anew, bidding those who are bound go free, and those who are in darkness come to light. There shall be pasture for my flock by the wayside. They shall have feeding grounds on all the barren uplands. They will hunger and thirst no more, nor will noonday heat or sun overpower them. Theirs is a merciful shepherd who will lead them to welling fountains and give them drink. And I will turn all these mountains of mine into a high road for you. Safe through the uplands my paths shall lead. See how they, are, see how they come from far away. And here are others from the north and the west, others again from the lands of the south. Ring out heaven with praise, let earth keep holiday, and its mountains echo that praise again. The Lord is bringing consolation to his people, taking pity on the helpless. Did Zion say, The Lord has forsaken me, my own master has forgotten me? What can a woman forget? What can a woman forget her child that is still unweaned? Have no pity to spare for the son she bore in her womb? Let her forget. I will not be forgetful of thee, says the Lord the Almighty. And the Holy Gospel today is a continuation of that according to St. John. At this time Jesus spoke to the Jewish crowd thus, I am the light of the world, he said. He who follows me can never walk in darkness. He will possess the light which is life. Whereupon the Pharisees told him, Thou art testifying on thy own behalf. Thy testimony is worth nothing. Jesus answered them, my testimony is trustworthy, even when I testify on my own behalf. I know whence I have come and where I am going. You do not know whence I have come. You do not know where I am going. You set yourselves up to judge after your earthly fashion. I do not set myself up to judge anybody. And what if I should judge? My judgment is judgment indeed. It is not I alone, my Father who sent me is with me. Just so it is prescribed in your law. The testimony of two men is trustworthy. Well, one is myself testifying in my own behalf, and my Father who sent me testifies in my behalf too. Hereupon they said to him, Where is this Father of thine? And Jesus answered, You have no knowledge, either of me or of my Father. Had you knowledge of me, you would have knowledge of my Father as well. All this Jesus said at the treasury, while he was teaching in the temple, and no one seized him, because his time had not yet come. Ave Maria, grazie plena Dominus tecum, benedicta tu mulieribus, e benedictus otus ventris tui, Jesus. Sancta Maria, Mater Dei, ortum nobis peccatoribus, nunc et ad animotis nostre. Amen. In nome de Patris et Filii, et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Carissimi, beloved in Christ, welcome to this broadcast Mass. On this, as we said, the fifth Saturday in Lent. On our spiritual pilgrimage of the stational churches in Rome today, uh, originally, we would have been at the Church of St. Lawrence again, uh, sorry, we would have been again at the Church of St. Lawrence outside the walls. But in the Middle Ages, this stational church was transferred to St. Nicholas in prison. Uh, this refers uh, to the church uh, in what used to be the uh, vegetable market of the ancient city of Rome. And uh, the church itself is built up uh, from... Uh, a mixture of two, at least two temples uh, that used to be on that site, one of them dedicated to piety. The collector today, uh, where the uh, faithful, the catechumen, the penitents, 
uh, gathered with the Bishop of Rome before Mass uh, was in the Church of, uh, of the Angels uh, in Piscibus, uh, meaning uh, in the fish market. And there they processed, reciting the Litany of Saints, uh, to the vegetable market and thus to the Church of St. Nicholas in Carcereon, St. Nicholas in prison, or as it was in those days, uh, they would have gone to uh, St. Lawrence outside the walls. The theme essentially for today rather sort of uh, culminates or wraps up or concludes all the uh, themes of uh, this past week, or we might say uh, of uh, Lent so far in its entirety. So we are reminded from uh, the Old Testament prophet Isaiah uh, how we as God's chosen people, like the Israelites before us, uh, have no need as it were, to dwell in darkness, have no need to dwell in despair, have no need to feel uh, forlorn, anxious, or to have lost hope, for God is indeed our good shepherd. He is answering our prayer, the day of our salvation has come, and he is promising us his assistance. And indeed, though we live in a ruined land, meaning of course the corrupted nature, the corrupted nature of uh, nature itself, of creation, Nonetheless, uh, we who uh, trust in the Lord, we who abide in the Lord, uh, we with whom the Lord is by our side, uh, can yet endure all the trials and tribulations and sufferings of this life. The Gospel speaks, what speaks to us of the testimony concerning Christ. Of course, there is his own account, as he points out to the Pharisees, but there also to that testimony given by his father, at least twice in the Gospels, of course, we hear this testimony from God himself. Firstly, at the great Theophany, on the occasion of our Lord's baptism in the River Jordan by St. John the Baptist, where the Trinity is revealed in the uh, person of Christ himself as the Son of God, uh, in the figure of the Holy Ghost uh, as a dove, and then in the voice of the Lord God from heaven, her to say, This is my, my Son, the Beloved. Likewise, too, the second occasion was at the Feast of the Transfiguration, where uh, on Mount Tabor, uh, Christ is transfigured, uh, perhaps, possibly, as far as we not might know, into his uh, resurrection body, uh, or into his high priestly body, uh, where he is seen with Moses and uh, Elijah talking about the new Exodus. This witnessed, of course, by the apostles, Peter, James, and John. And there they hear God speak to them directly to say, this is my son, my begotten, uh, listen to him. And otherwise too, of course, God, we may say, has testified in the divine nature of Christ through the performance uh, of all the miracles that have demonstrated, uh, not only, of course, uh, the divinity and the compassion of Christ, but so too of God's favour in Christ and through Christ toward those who are humble and contrite, toward those who in faith turn to him, who manifest trust in him, and in him meaning, of course, uh, the embodiment of the uh, Trinity in the Son of God, our Saviour Jesus Christ, in the Word made flesh. All of this, then, my brothers and sisters, Holy Mother Church desires to give us a final word of comfort and consolation from tomorrow, of course, is Passion Sunday, where the Saviour will be hidden from us, uh, figuratively speaking, of course, the uh, crosses and uh, icons, the statues and pictures uh, will all be veiled in Passion Veiling, reflecting those words at the end of tomorrow's Gospel. Uh, where the Lord went and hid himself. And so without, we will be without, as it were, uh, that consolation which otherwise we perhaps take uh, so much for granted in the uh, visible presentations of the visible presence of our Lord upon the cross and in the holy icons and in the pictures and uh, statuary of our churches. All these are to be veiled and to be covered 
really with the aid, of course, that we might enter more deeply into uh, Passion Tide, that we may focus more particularly on the passion and suffering of our Saviour and seek to marry uh, by a sense of loss and sorrow for ourselves, uh, marry our, loss, our sense of loss and sorrow to that of our Lord's for us. And so we will not see the image of our Lord again, as it were, until the veneration of the cross on Good Friday. In many ways, this will uh, enable uh, the drama of the liturgy of the Sacrum Triduum uh, to uh, be realised uh, to full effect. It is, and then all those of you who have uh, experienced it, uh, if you know, if you if you have noticed, if you notice during uh, Passion Tide and the beginning of Holy Week, the absence of the images of our Saviour, uh, it is quite something when uh, the corpus on the cross is revealed uh, and then uh, exposed for veneration on Good Friday, to see uh, the uh, to see the suffering Saviour uh, again upon the tree of life for us. And so what remains, my brothers and sisters, for us to uh, uh, prepare ourselves uh, this for this Passion Tide, to deepen particularly our sense of prayer. You will notice that in the liturgy of Passion Tide, uh, it takes upon it uh, something of the uh, manifestation of sorrow that we uh, otherwise experience uh, for requiems, uh, for the uh, loss of the faithful departed. For example, the joyful entrance uh, psalm uh, of the Yudhikame uh, is taken away during Passion Tide. Uh, uh, and other similar aspects uh, reflecting the requiem uh, mass uh, become uh, part of the ordinary mass of Passion Tide. And these things, my brothers and sisters, are deliberately uh, given to us, as Holy Mother Church, of course, is always solicitous uh, for our edification, is always seeking to enable us to draw more closely to God, indeed to experience uh, more deeply our knowledge and sense of God, that we may indeed learn to live in holy fear meaning, of course, to live always aware of the presence of God. And this may seem strange. It's a, a strange kind of, um, I don't know, uh, a juxtaposition that on the one hand we veil the images, uh, but on the other hand are encouraged to identify ourselves more closely uh, with God, particularly in Christ, in the throes of his uh, passion. And all of this, of course, uh, is about charity. It is about enabling us uh, to, uh, during Passion Tide, again, understand more deeply the love of God made manif manifest for us uh, in Christ, that he should have to undergo this suffering, that he should have to undergo uh, this final temptation, that he should have to undergo this ultimate sacrifice in love for us upon the cross. Our thoughts during Passion Tide, too, of course, are turned toward our own need for this salvation. We are almost, as it were, uh, encouraged by Holy Mother Church through, the sense of, through a sense of loss and sorrow in the way that the liturgy and our churches are altered during this time to wallow a little, perhaps in self-pity, perhaps in self-sorrow, to inculcate within us a true contrition, a true understanding of our need uh, to repent, of our need for a saviour, of our need for a redeemer. Because, of course, so often, my brothers and sisters, we take all these things for granted. However pious some of us are striving to be, however much we may attend or hear daily Mass, however much 
we may spend time in prayer and Lectio Divina, they can of course grow a contempt through familiarity with holy things. It is something particularly that the clergy uh, need uh, often to address for themselves. The Passion Tide then becomes a time when, through the uh, changes brought about in the liturgy and in, the, and in our churches, uh, to shake us, as it were, from our uh, conceit and try to refocus our minds. You see, we are supposed to notice that the images have been failed. We are supposed to notice the alterations to the liturgy. Holy Mother Church seeks always to appeal to our senses in order to inform and transform our minds, to engage our higher intellect. to guide aright our emotions, that we may indeed respond to the truth. Let us then, my brothers and sisters, take this final thought of consolation, compassion and hope to ourselves, that through the next two weeks of Passion Tide, we may not lose sight as the Apostles did, of the glory of Mount Tabor, nor lose sight, as the Israelites did, of the continuing presence of our God, even in our deepest and darkest hours. Let us open our eyes to see with faith the lessons in the liturgy and in the churches and in the lessons that Holy Mother Church seeks to prevent seeks to present to us, to enable us to more closely identify ourselves with our suffering Saviour, that we may more perfectly and more joyfully appreciate the gift of his love made manifest for us upon Good Friday and celebrate the resurrection at Easter. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Ghost. Dominus suaviscum et cum spirito tuo. Padre, Patus est dominus firmamentum meum, et refugium meum, et liberatum meus, et sperabo in eum.
seculor Amen. Dominus vobiscum et cum spirito tuo sosum corda, habemus et dominum gracias et amus domino Deo nostro. Dignum et iuscum est. Veri dignum et iusem et tecum et salutari nos tibi sempre et uvi quae gracias angele domine sancte pater unipotens et tenet Deus. Perfect. Qui corporali et junio vicia comprimis metem elevas virtutem agiris et premia, per Christum Dominum nostrum. Ecum est statum cum laudo d'angeli adorantum relationes gene potestate est genis erumque vetutem de beate serve fim socius ut actione concelebrant, con cui usa nostris voces usa mit iubeste precavo suplici confessione dicenda. Sanctus, Sanctus, Sanctus. Dominus Deus Sabbath, plenis un cieli et terra gloria tua, Hosanna in excelsis. In benedicus qui veniti nomine Domini, Hosanna in excelsis.
تو به کده دار بود Mi assicura sicuro al orre sprece di salutare bus mole fide fine soluzione formati al demus dice Fata nostra di qui es in cieli sangue di cieco non un tum e bene a re un tum che è volontà sua sicuro in cielo e in terra Padre nostro quadriam de nobis fodi e dimite nobis debita nostra sicuro nostri mitimus debitori bus nostri et ne nos inducas in tentazione de libra nossa mão. Terra minha secula seculor, a exa domini sit sempero vobiscum, et cum spirito tuo. Ecce agnus Dei, ecce qui tolit peccato mundi. Domine non sunt dignus ut in tres ut pectum meum, se tantum de verbo et sen nabitur anima mea. Domine non sunt dignus ut in tres ut pectum meum, se tantum de verbo et sen nabitur anima mea. Domine non sunt dignus ut in tres ut pectum meum, se tantum de verbo et sen nabitur anima mea. Brothers and sisters, watching Mass online and unable therefore to receive the Blessed Sacrament, we invite you now to make an act of spiritual communion. My Jesus, I believe that Thou art present in the Blessed Sacrament. I love Thee above all things, and I desire Thee in my soul. Since I cannot now receive Thee sacramentally, come at least spiritually into my heart. 
As though thou wert already there, I embrace thee and unite myself wholly to thee. Permit not that I should ever be separated from thee. Amen. Domino suaviscum et cum spirito tu. Barnebus. Deus, qui sperantibus in temis de deni, potius elicis, pameri asci, da nobis digni e flere mala, quae fecimus, ut tuoi cancellationis, grazie mi venire me le amor. Perd. Tua nos praesimus, domini sancta purifice, in te nocolationis sua tibi placitos esse perficiam. Per Domino nostrum, Iesum Christum, Filium Tum, 
Vedai Pugri Vadarani Atunelitati Suripusanti Devis Paramya Sekura Sekurormum Ad Ordebus Mundre Pugna Nos Christus Tavani Divini Sacramenti Mulus Blatum Et in the Shudente Viate Vigna Et in Genetice Maria Cum Beatu Iosi Featis Apostis Tu Ispetu Et Paula Tue Beatis Cut Mani Tu Infini Et Omnibus Sanctis Alcuntis Nos Vede De Pepe Sassisibus Ex Beatos Et De Pepe Sassisibus Ex Medi Purificet nos caesimus omnipotens e misericordus Deus, sacramentu quae sunsimus, et in trucidensimus omnibus sanctis tuis presta. Ut hoc tuum sacramentum non sin nobis reatus et penam, sed in secessio salutaris et venam. Sit abruzio schlerum, sit potitudo fragilium, sit contra omnia mundi pericula firmamentum. Sit vivorum atque motuorum fedelum remissio omnium de leibonum. Per Dominum nostrum iesum Christum finium tuum, Qui Dei cum vive da regna, tu nell'etate, Spiritus Sancti Deus, per la mia secula seculorum. Ad. Ordebus. Deus, qui speranzi bus in tebe sedeti, potius erigis qua medasci, da nobis linee flere male quae fecimus, o tu in consolazione sprazia me venire me reamo. Per Dominum nostrum, Iesu Christum, Filium tuum. Qui Dei cum vive da regna, tu nell'etate, Spiritus Sancti Deus, Perra mia secula seculorum. Ad. Dominus obiscum et cum spirito tuo. Benedicamus Domino Deo grazie. In nome Domino in benedictum ex onum cadusque in secula ut utorum nostrum in nome de Domini tui feci cerum et terram. Benedicat vos omnipotens Deum. Pater et Filius et Spiritus Sanctus. Ab. In Domino suaviscum et cum spirito tuo initium sancti Evangelii secundum Dio Pandem. Gloria a Tibita. In principio, ora e verbum, e verbum, ora e tabu Deum, e Deus, ora e verbum, ho chiarato in principio, ora e tabu Deum. Omnia prezzo fatto, sunti, sim so fatto, mis nilbo fatto, mis. In ipso viterat, e viterat, lus famen, vulus in terno, es luce, e terno, e non comprehende Deum. Tu e tu mo messo sedere con nemmeno l'arci guarde, si tveni che in testimoni, mu testimoni, be peri, tu lumine, e tomne sperdum, tu ilum. Non eri te rei luxe, tu testimoni, be peri, tu lumine, era lux vera, qua lumina tomne, ma omine, veniente, mi ho pundum. In mundo e l'altro, muros prezzo fatto, sesto, muros e non cognoghi, e in proprio veni che sono non eccepperon. Corporal temo eccepperon, tem des forestati, infirio sei fieri, che scrivendi in nome eis. Qui non è sanguinico, sex volentati, cani, sex volentati, viri, se li deuna di sunt. E verum carum factum eis, et abitabit in nome se virimus gloria, meus gloria, in quasi vincenti a pace, e venum grazia e veritatis. Deo grazia. Grace the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Oh, Mary, for the grace the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Oh, Mary, for the grace the Lord is with thee, blessed are thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and in the hour of our death. Amen. Hail, Holy Queen, Mother of Mercy, hail our life, our sweetness and our hope. To thee do we cry, poor banished children of Eve. To thee do we send up our sighs, mourning and weeping in this veil of tears. Turn then, most gracious Advocate, thine eyes of mercy toward us, and after this our exile show unto us the blessed fruit of thy womb, Jesus. O clement, O loving, O sweet Virgin Mary, pray for us, O Holy Mother of God, that we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ. Let us pray. O God, who art our refuge and our strength, look down in mercy on thy people who cry to thee, and by the intercession of the glorious and blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, St. Joseph, her spouse, of thy blessed Apostles, Peter and Paul, and of all thy saints. In mercy, when we hear our prayers for the conversion of sinners and for the liberty and exaltation of our Holy Mother, the Church, we ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. Holy Michael, Archangel, defend us in the day of battle. Be our safeguard against the wickedness and snares of the devil. May God rebuke him, we humbly pray, and do thou, Prince of the Heavenly Host, by the power of God, press down to hell Satan and all wicked spirits who wander through the world for the ruin of souls. Amen. 
Lord Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, have mercy upon me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, have mercy upon me, a sinner. Lord Jesus Christ, Son of the living God, have mercy upon me, a sinner. May St. Nicholas and Catherine pray for us. St. Catherine of Stenning, pray for us. St. Richard of Chichester, pray for us. St. Wilfred of York, pray for us. St. Willie Broad of Utrecht, pray for us. St. Louina of Alfriston, pray for us. Our Lady of Walsingham, pray for us. Our Holy Guardian Angels, pray for us. Our Heavenly Patron Saints, pray for us. Our Lady Queen of Heaven, all the angels and saints, pray for us.